What's up guys, Logs here, and yes, today we finally have some World at War gameplay. You guys know this is my favorite Call of Duty, one of the best in my opinion, it was very underlooked because we went from COD 4 to World at War back to World War II when it first came out. It was very underappreciated, a lot of people went back to COD 4, but man, World at War for me when it first came out was one of the best experiences. I absolutely love World War II era. Some of you might know I have a World War II gun collection because of how much I just love the history behind it. And this was a perfect World War II game. I mean, it had the grunginess, the the gore. This was the first game that had like blood and gore for Call of Duty. It was just super like just realistic and fun. I remember the first time playing this game was the beta back when they had open betas and stuff. And I remember getting on the beta, joining a game of Roundhouse and seeing that you can get in tanks and drive them was the, like the craziest thing to me. Drivable tanks in the beta was super, super crazy. And also I remember getting into a game on castle and people just under the map shooting me because there's like a glitch where you can just crawl into the map it was crazy yeah man war to war one of the best games in my opinion and i'm happy to be bringing more content out i know a lot of you guys know me for war to war content which is why you subscribed and since i'm doing more of these personality you know commentary cut com kind of videos i uh, decided to get back on the game and put another video out to show you guys that war to war in 2021 is still playable i joined up and i got a full game within minutes it's really easy to get a game um it just kind of depends on what time of day you play now for this gameplay i was playing on PlayStation 3 which is why it's not the best quality but uh, you can also get some on Xbox I see people on Xbox all the time playing it's really fun like a lot of people are still on the game it's definitely dead but at the same time you know people can still play it so you can still jump on the game and play along with some of the old CODs too I'd hate to see a day where we just can't play the old CODs because War to War you guys know the campaign was amazing just everything about this game is nostalgic for me it was the first game to bring zombies into the mix when you beat the campaign, you can actually unlock zombies and play zombies. I remember hearing about that in middle school where my friend said, if you beat the campaign, you unlock this zombie mission. I was like, there's no way, it's, it's not possible. So I went home and I ended up beating that campaign that night. And then like this credits roll, everything's done. And I'm like, dude, he was lying to me. And then just that little animation where you crash the plane and then the zombie comes running up to you, like just so frightening. What do you think, Moose? Did you like World of War Zombies? Did you like the game? Yeah? Is that a yes for me? Is that a yes? But yeah, once you spawned in and like just the noises like ah, ha, 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 like the <laughs> the noises in Call of Duty Zombies and just World of War in general, like everything about the game was awesome. When you capture a flag on a war, you hear hoorah, hoorah. Just the sound effects in the game were just awesome and the sniping was grungy, the PTRS was meaty. We're gonna see all these snipers in the gameplay today. I use them all. Yeah guys, I hope you guys enjoy like the sniping content and just this personality content that I'm putting out. I to play more games in the future so let me know in the comments what games you want me to play mw2 black ops 2 world war 2 cold war any of these games i'm basically gonna take these videos and see how well they do and see if i want to continue doing them or just try to do something else so every like means a lot every comment means a lot and also subscribe if you're new man turn the notification bell on because we're on the road to 10,000 subscribers can't wait to play and make more content videos for you guys so yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh uh, yeah, drop a like, subscribe, and I'm out. Deuces. Dogs in this game are definitely something I do not miss at all when playing. Dogs are so annoying in this game compared to like other games like, uh, you know, Black Ops 2 and stuff. Like these dogs were by far the worst. Dude, I have to hold off the dogs. 
Oh my god. I love that, man. Black ASAP. This is a guy who hasn't left Ward at War in years. Still to this day, try harding on every game. Always try harding. Just never stops playing the game. There's always people like that, though. Like, there's always people who never get off the game. I guess technically I am a part of that as well. I mean, I haven't gotten off this game in so long because I just, I don't know. I enjoy playing it. I'm so used to playing like. 120 fps on like cold war it's so weird coming back and playing these old games because it's only 60 fps so the reason i'm on uh playstation 3 instead of xbox is because ps3 is actually a little bit more populated it seems uh in the morning at least seems like there's always people on in the morning in my time and uh on xbox i don't know sometimes there's people on sometimes there's not i remember this game used to be completely ruined by like modding but uh it's it's actually not that bad anymore there's not too many modders i remember back when this game was just absolutely ruined completely by modders like you couldn't even join a game and everything was like pink and blue like they used like these fog effects infections and stuff it's actually not terrible these days like you can get on the game and not find too many modders and when you do find them you know it's it's only very randomly that you find them I feel like people who uh, use like the god mode infections and all that stuff like they eventually just got bored of it because of how stupid it was let me go off I've had so many great memories on this game, man. You know, from search and destroy to zombies to everything about this game, which is so much fun. Like the OG players who remember this game just know how much fun it was back in the day. What the f What the fuck is this guy doing? <laughs> Yeah, man, I remember coming home from school and uh, just playing Search and Destroy. Like, for some reason, this game, Search and Destroy, was the most fun on. I had more fun on Search on this game than on MW2, which is like the holy grail for Search and Destroy. I don't know, man, something about World War II, it's just always been a fan favorite for me. Uh, I just love playing World War II games, and just the, just the grittiness of this game is just so much fun. The weird thing about Hardcore is it seems like the best guns are the ones that aren't good in core. Like... In core, you'd use the MP40 Thompson, but in hardcore, you're gonna use like the M1A1, like semi-automatic, or the STG or something. Cause honestly, damage doesn't really matter in hardcore. Like you're always gonna kill in like a one or two shot. The biggest problem with hardcore search back then was the noob tubes. Like people would spawn in and shoot a noob tube across the map and get like a quad and they eventually had to patch it so it got bad to the point where they had to patch it and what they did was they made it so explosives couldn't be used or, or they didn't like blow up for the first like 10 seconds of the game i think that's how bad spawn tubing was on surge destroyed like they made it so the grenades literally wouldn't blow up there was honestly just something magical about this game when it came to playing it like back in the day i just had the most fun on this game out of like any call of duty and yeah this game isn't like probably the best call of duty but it's my favorite call of duty if that makes sense obviously there's games like cod 4 mw2 black ops 2 that are always going to be like at a higher tier than war at war but War at War is just legendary in itself. The fact that this game had the first zombies, the first uh, co-op campaign or something, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, the first co-op campaign. Without this game, there w literally wouldn't be zombies, so you can kind of thank this game for that. The MP40 is so broken in this game. I remember seeing the first quad headshot view with this gun from like Shady, and uh, it was just such a crazy clip. I never like went for quad headshot feeds with uh, red guns though. The World War Quad Times really brought this game back to life back in the day. Like people left MW2 and played War at War just because the World War Quad Dodge came out. How big that video was back in the day is actually insane to me. Yeah, dude, because I'm playing on PS3 and 720p, it's uh, it really is lagging it. The best clip I ever hit on this game, like actual legit clip, is that uh, that quad headshot feed times two with uh, three guns that I hit for Snipe and Showdown. So many people thought that clip was modded, but no, I, I literally just jumped into a game of TDM, uh, put EO in the clan tag and uh, just went off. I'll play that clip for you right now. After I hit that, I was literally freaking out and I uh, sent it to uh, Alistair, uh, who was one of the judges, to like watch the full gameplay of. There's so many aspects of this game that I just absolutely love. The blood and guts on this game have just been insane. This was the first game where they actually had like blood and guts uh, because they didn't have it on COD 4. Like this literally felt like a World War II shooter, like how just how gruesome the game was and it just felt awesome. This right here is one of the best things about this game, the PTR. 
TRS. As I get killed by Uwu LMK, what the hell? This PTRS is by far the best gun in the game. I know people probably don't like it as much as the bolts because Just look at that though. The PTRS is just so quick. It's so much faster than the bolts and uh, you can actually stack with it. So absolutely love this gun. It's my favorite sniper in the game. Uh, it's just, it's just awesome. Snipers that people usually don't use are the Car 98 for some reason. And obviously the Mosin because the Mosin just is terrible. Like it's so hard to use the Mosin. I don't even think I have a class with the Mosin. That's how hard it is. Yeah, I don't even have a class with it. So this is one clip I've always wanted to hit like the jump shot Nosk. I've never hit that all the years of playing. If I hit it for the video, I'd be actually pretty happy. Oh my god, it was it was there. It was actually there. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh my god, he's right there. Oh. <laughs> I can't believe I just did that. I've been trying that for years just to hit the jump shot Nosk, and I actually just hit it. Even sniper lobbies in this game, like, they're annoying because of snaking, but it's still not to the point where it's like COD 4. Like this will never be a COD 4 SL. And the fact that we have a full game right now on Team Deathmatch on PlayStation 3 just says it all. Like people have always loved this game. It's just not getting the recognition that it has, that it deserves. Now I have dogs. So that's the big thing on World of War. If you're playing World of War, the etiquette is to not call in dogs or artillery. They are just so annoying. And when you play against them, they're just so annoying. Macon was a map that was just so good and just no one really talks about. I absolutely love the World of War maps. Like these were just so good for like the time period and everything. Like they're realistic and they're fun to play. Oh, come on, man. I really missed that. Really don't understand how good these classic maps were, like Macon, Roundhouse, Upheaval, Downfall. These were like some of the best maps in Call of Duty history. One of the best things about this game was definitely the fucking flamethrower. This thing, <laughs> when people use this thing, it's so much fun. I remember the first time I unlocked this and I was just so happy. Like I only wanted to use this on multiplayer. The fact that it has unlimited ammo, and you can just fucking burn people? Like, how crazy is this gun? Oh my god, dude. Put the MP40 down, ooh, ooh. I just realized that you can actually aim down sight with this. What? He probably thinks that I'm like actually like just being a dickhead for using this, but I'm trying to make a video, dude. Sorry. I forgot that you can't lay down when you're using this thing. That's enough flamethrower for today. I'm not using that anymore. You know, as old as this game is, you really don't see a lot of like highlight videos or anything on this game. You always see them on like COD 4, MW2, Black Ops 2. No one really uploaded videos on this, like content on this game. I think my long uh, subscribers who've been following me for a while know that I've always uploaded content on this game, like live stream highlights and, uh, you know, just different kinds of videos. Oh my god, dude, imagine that triple. There are so many awesome clips that have never been hit on this game because of how hard sniping is. So essentially, if you guys don't know, snaking, you lay down, you sprint, you lay down, you sprint. And basically, it just shows you just walk floating around on the ground for no reason. It's War to War can be really frustrating when you're playing against snipers, but in general, uh, I don't think it's all that crazy. Like, MW2 frustrated me way more than this game ever has, and I've played this game more than any other Call of Duty. Oh, wow. Oh, you bitch, dude. Well, guys, that was World at War in 2021. It's been so long since I've played this game. It's fun to come back and play it. Tell me in the comments if you like this kind of content, the cut comms on the old CODs, just going back, playing them, talking about them. And be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. If we get 10,000 subscribers by the end of the year, I'll be super happy, man. Let me know if you guys like this content. Other than that, I am out for the second time today. But uh, yeah, I'm out. Deuces.